Hello guys, this is Anthony. I believe many of you can easily name a few of the biggest glove manufacturers in Malaysia. What about other industries? Today, let's talk about a company which is the largest electronics manufacturing services or EMS player in Malaysia. On the plate today, we have BS Industry with the stock name BS and stock code 6963. Listed on the main market of Busan, Malaysia, BS Industry Berhad has 35 years of proven track record in undertaking the manufacturing needs of global brands names for household electricals and electronics products. A homegrown company from Johor, BS is among the world's top 50 EMS providers. Together with its Hong Kong listed subsidiary, BS International Group Limited, BS has manufacturing facilities located in Malaysia, China, Indonesia and Vietnam which collectively employ a workforce of 12,000 people. Founded by its current executive chairman, Dato' Bae Kim Ling, BS was originally established in Singapore back in 1979 before he made the decision to relocate the entire business operations back to Johor Bahru in 1982. Dato' Bae's leadership and entrepreneurial skills have helped advance the group to be an international player in the field of EMS. Recently, I had the rare opportunity to produce some meaningful content with this low-profile businessman, so do look forward to that. Now back to the company, with a market cap of approximately 4.7 billion ringgit, BS has consistently recorded a yearly net profit of over 100 million over the last five years. Notably, BS has a policy to pay out 40% of its net profit as dividend. They have been generous with dividends for the past 10 years and this will serve as a strong support for any downside risk to investors. So what's next for BS? The company is expected to deliver solid growth as it stands to benefit from the US-China trade war as well as the shifting consumer behaviours resulting from the COVID-19 pandemic and customers are increasingly looking at the Southeast Asia way and BS is a top choice given their ability to be a one-stop manufacturing solutions provider. For instance, in March 2019, BS successfully signed with a US customer whose products were previously manufactured by China-based EMS providers. The total of 9 models from this US customer is estimated to contribute 900 million ringgit to VS financial year 2021 top line. Then in August 2020, BS secured another big contract worth 600 million ringgit from another new US customer, Victory Innovations. According to reports, BS is in the midst of active negotiations with a few prospective customers and discussions are in its final stages. Around the world, widespread lockdown together with the new normal of human lifestyle have also led to the sudden increase in demand for household products which are produced by BS. For example, the rise in orders for coffee machines for retailers to stock up before Christmas and year-end sales. Meanwhile, as part of its expansion plan, BS had on 14 October announced that it is buying six pieces of land with industrial buildings in Sunai, Johor for 98.8 million ringgit. This will help to increase BS production capacity for future expansion purposes, including capturing opportunity arising from the US-China trade tension. According to reports, BS has just secured a new US customer producing home appliances. Although beginning with the production of one model, this customer's contribution could be as sizable as BS other US based customers, estimated to reach approximately 1 billion ringgit top line contribution in the next two years, with a total three models up for grabs. Yobi Gahin said in a recent report that the glory days of BS may be back with the latest acquisition and a new large US based customer. The research house has given BS a buy call with a target price of 3 ringgit. On its share price performance, BS fell to its low of 63.5 cent in March this year on the back of movement control order MCO. Like other stocks, it rebounded quickly and together with positive news of securing new customers, its share price has increased almost 300% at the time of recording from its lowest point this year. Alright everyone, that's all for my sharing of BS today. Please remember to subscribe to my channel and leave a like on the video for the YouTube algorithm. See you again soon. Bye.